guys, this is Andrew Lee. I'll read the book, The Joke Machine, and the author of Reading Tree Series, series created by Robert Kunt and Alex Bricta. Let's go right into it. Everyone was in the playground. I've got a good joke, said Wolf. What goes black, white, black, white? I don't know, said Biff. A penguin rolling down a hill, said Wolf. I've got one, said Anina. Why couldn't the skeleton go to the party? Why couldn't the skeleton go to the party, asked Chip. It had no body to go with, said Anina. Time to come inside, called Mrs. May. Line up quietly, everyone. What do sea monsters eat, said Nadin. Fish and chips. That's a terrible joke, said Biff. All of these are actually. Get in, you chatterboxes, said Mrs. May. Didn't you hear the whistle? Sorry, Mrs. May, said Wolf. We were telling jokes. Well, it's time to stop now, said Mrs. May. Mrs. May, called Biff. What does an elephant do on a motorway? Now, now, Biff, said Mrs. May. Tell me later. And you go, everyone. Biff, whispered at him. What does an elephant do on a motorway? About two miles an hour, said Biff. Biff, madam, said Mrs. May. Go inside quietly. It was nearly time to go home. Well done, said Mrs. May. You have worked hard today. Now it's time to tidy up. Mrs. May, called Anina. Do you want to hear one of Nana's jokes? Well, just one, said Mrs. May. I want to get home tonight. Why do cows wear bells? asked Anina. I don't know, said Mrs. May. Why do cows wear bells? Because their horns don't work, said Adam. Mrs. May clapped her hands. I want to ask you something, she said. Who knows about Help the Children Day? There's a special day, said Chip. People raise money to help children, said Wolf. How could we raise money for Help the Children Day? asked Mrs. May. We'll have to think hard. Said Nina, "Tell me your ideas tomorrow." Said Mrs. May. Everyone was at Beth and Chip's house. I can't think of anything," said Chip. "Nor can I," said Nina. "What ideas have we had so far?" asked Biff. "Read out the list, Nadim." Nadim read out the list. Ideas for help the children: washing cars, toy sale. That's only two ideas," said Nina. "Well." We've only had two ideas," said Wolf. "I don't think washing cars is a good idea," said Chip. "I don't think Mrs. May would let us." And I gave all my old toys to the last toy sale," said Wolf. "And now they had a good idea. What about a joke machine?" he said. He told them all about his idea. Everyone was excited. I can't wait to tell Mrs. May," said Chip. The next day, they were back at school. Mrs. May called Anina. We've got an idea for help the children. It must be a good one," said Mrs. May. "You all sound excited." They told Mrs. May what the idea was. "It's a joke machine," said Biff. "We write jokes on slips of paper," said Chip. "Then we put the jokes in a box." "Box is the joke machine," said Wolf. "It's a great idea," said Anina. "People pay for a joke. They give the money," said Wolf. And they get a joke from the box. I think it's a lovely idea," said Mrs. May. But I can see one problem. What's that? Everyone asked. We will need lots and lots of jokes," said Mrs. May. And it, and it even have to be funny. I really hate all those jokes. Yeah, too common. We can all find jokes for free on Google, like YouTube or something. Yeah. I like that idea. The joke machine was finished. It's brilliant," said Chip. "Look, I finished the poster." A laugh does you good," read Wolf. "Do good with a laugh." We have put the jokes on the computer. Now we can print them off," said Nadim. And here's the next one. What game do horses play? Stable tennis," laughed Anina. "How many jokes have we got?" asked Wolf. "49," said Nadim. I wish we had some more. Here is one more for you," 
said Mrs. May. What can fly and has four legs? We don't know, they all said. What can fly and have four legs? Two birds, asked Mrs. May. Everyone laughed. Yeah, I get the joke. I'm not satisfied. I'm going to teach you to a more joke. They took the joke machine to the shopping center. Row up, row up, they shouted. Support the children. Buy a joke for not less than 50 pounds. Is it a penny? 50p. It's a British book, so I guess pounds? 50 pounds. A man came up to buy a joke. You've given us a pound, called Chip. Thank you very much. The man wanted them all to tell the joke. So they towed it together. What has only one foot? They all said. I don't know, said the man. What has only one foot? A leg, they said. Everyone laughed. What? It's just really a joke. I have some good news, said Mrs. May. The mayor loves your joke machine. She wants to buy all your jokes. Guess how much she will pay for each one. We don't know, said everyone. How much will she pay for each one? Two pounds, said Mrs. May. Fifty jokes at two pounds each, said Adam. That's a hundred pounds. But we've sold twenty jokes, said Ruth. There are only thirty left. I've been putting them back, said Adam. There are still fifty in there. Three cheers for Adam, said Anina. It was his brilliant idea. And three cheers for the joke machine, said Mrs. May. We thought of another joke, said Adam. What card game do crocodiles like? You don't know, they all said. What card games do crocodile like? Snap, said Adam. Everyone groaned. Okay. I'm not dissatisfied with the book, but if you're satisfied with this video, please consider subscribing. I almost add 1,000 subscribers and watching my videos and subscribing to this channel will give me a lot of support and I really hope I can see you in the next one. Take care.